Hi guys, very excited to be live on Facebook. It's been a wonderful day so far, launching my book, which comes out tomorrow. Um, been so many good people that have turned up to the book launch, my family, my friends. I'm very thankful to Pam McMillan and Malcolm Knox who helped me with my book. I'm very thankful to all my friends and family that have played such a big part in my, my journey. And what I love most about this book is it's not just about cricket, it's about that. It's about the journey, the 35 years I've had and the highs and lows. And I really hope young boys and girls can learn and, and take some of my experiences away from it and, and help them with, with their future. Whatever their dream is, I'd love to see you chase that. So how about I answer a few of your questions and we go from there. What do we got here? We've got a lot of hellos. Hello to everybody. Hello from Nepal. Can't wait to get a copy. Very good to see you. <laughs> We've got a lot of hellos at the moment. Hi to everybody. Hi to everybody. Sandeep. Sandeep, my young friend from Nepal, is doing fantastic. He's here today at my book launch. He's playing for Western Suburbs and doing really well. We, uh, we've had a couple of wins, a couple of losses, but he's learning a lot. So it's, uh, it's fantastic for him to be here in Australia. I've loved being able to help him with his cricket. Hopefully he can stay here and help West have a fantastic summer. What else have we got here? Plenty in Nepal. How are, we, how are you enjoying being a father? I love being a dad. It's one of the things I talk about in my book, uh, how it's changed my life to be you know, Kelsey Lee's father and um, to experience so much in my journey. Now I have the chance to be able to give back to her and really help her chase her dream and achieve her dreams. And you know, that's a big part of why I wrote the book because in life you don't know what can happen. And if something was to happen to me and I passed away, Right now, at 11 months old, my daughter wouldn't know who I was. But I think if she reads this book in time, she'll get a really good understanding of who I am and my values and what I believe in. So I hope she's proud of it one day when she gets to read it. And I hope she chases her dreams and is proud of who she is as a person. How do I see the future of Sandeep? I think he's got a bright future. I don't want to put too much pressure on him. I think right now it's really important that Sandeep enjoys his cricket, continues to learn. He's playing in Australia, which is really different conditions to, to what he gets in Nepal. But overall, I think that'll help his future. I think that'll help him improve. And I think he's got so much talent, he'll be able to, be, he'll be able to perform and be successful in any part of the world. And speaking of Sandeep, he's here now. Sandeep, come and say hello, say hello to your friends. Here he is, the young hello. man. Namaste. <laughs> if you come down. Sure. There you go. And you can see the camera. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, look, he's, you had a good time in Australia? Yeah, it's good time. Lovely people. I'm enjoying here. No worry about me. Because Michael is with me. He's a good man. Uh, I love him very much. I love Australia. What about and, the book? Oh. You uh, like? Yeah, I like. Uh, can I say something to Nepalese people in Nepali? Of course. Uh, uh, just believe God in all of I will gonna do best and best. Soyoko lagi, Soyoko lagi, Soyoko lagi, Egdom, Dere, Dere, Dhanevad. On your book, Sri Egdom, Naya Bukatsomako, Wago Life for Story of Barima, I read some of pages, I know, Wako, Egdom, Ramro lagi, Molai. Uh, please, our husband boy bunny, actually part dinu ala Good boy. Thank, Thank you, you, buddy. Thank you very much. What a lovely young man. Uh, I would love to come to Nepal and spend some time with with Sandeep and his family and try and help Nepalese cricket. I've always followed the 2020 competitions around the world, the IPL, the PSL, the CPL. Um, all those tournaments uh, have been fantastic for cricket, and I'll be following the PSL again closely this year. Uh, I look forward to seeing which team wins and. Uh, all the international players that are a part of it and you never know one day I might be over there playing or coaching or associated with it But you know, I love seeing these 2020 competitions all around the world. I think it's fantastic for the game of cricket I think it gives young players an opportunity to be on that that stage and show their show their class and Who knows maybe young Sandeep he might be a part of a few of these 2020 competitions around the world very soon